When it comes to roaring techniques, there's no hard set rules. So it's, it's a lot of it's just trial and error. So you've got to try something. If you do nothing, then probably nothing will happen at all unless a stag's roaring by himself. So you're better to make some noise. Don't be afraid to make a sound. Don't worry how it sounds if you think, oh, you know, it doesn't sound that good. Mine doesn't sound that good either, but you just got to make something. So um, we might, for example, go into an area and if, if there's nothing happening, it's all quiet. We think, okay, we'll give a roar and uh, hopefully something will answer. So we'll just give an ordinary sort of a... Just see what happens. If it's all quiet, you might think, okay, we'll give a bit more, you know, try and work something up a little bit. So you'll give a few more roars. If still nothing, then you might think, okay, we've got to try and stimulate something. So we're going to give a bit of what we call violence. So you do a bit of the old... sort of thing and you hopefully the stag's thinking oh I'm getting a bit agitated at that so he lets out a roar and then once he's going hopefully you can just correspond and keep him going and you get another occasion where a stag's roaring and you're roaring to him you start moving closer next thing he sort of goes quiet and you can't get him to roar again you think oh what do I do now so what we'll often do is actually keep quiet ourselves not make a sound and wait them out because sometimes they like to know where you are but once you've stopped he starts to think oh, where is he so he'll let out a roar and then you can pinpoint him and head for him again of course then you get other situations and a stag's going off his nut he's really you know worked up and in a case like that keep him worked up get him angry <laughs> So just bellow at him as much as you can and um, even interrupt him, you know, really make him worked up as can be. Because the most exciting you can get is when you get him coming in close. So at that stage hopefully he'll just come in fast and uh, that's a real buzz. <coughs> You know, a lot of guys out there, of course, have got all their techniques and they know exactly what they're doing and it works really well. But with us, if you do what we say, if it doesn't work, don't blame us. Because a lot of the time it doesn't work for us either. So there you go. It's a bit further up I think, might try and make some ground up, go a little bit further but better position if possible, keep quiet.
Oh, oh, oh.